Hello everyone, are you ready for another fucking adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm here with some Pitter Patter Pop. And I'm gonna be playing some Pitter Patter Pop. I'm gonna be doing the Oinkle Boinkle event, because I needed to do it and it just got released. Uh, before I do that, I'm just gonna do one quick ticket pull and see if I can pull Oinkle or Boinko. Let's see. Either one of them. I honestly can't remember which one's which. I just always assumed them to be a pair. No, I got the old man. The old man eating a burger. That's a shame. Oh well. Nope, I don't want to do that. So we're going to go in here for a bit. Uh, this is a points style reward, so it's actually very good to constantly play and keep doing it. I don't remember... Oh man. What color do I need for this one? Okay, I can't see what color it is, so hopefully I have the starting color. If it's not, then we're just going to figure out, and we're going to keep replaying it till I do. I would use Google Translate, but then that would literally stop this video, and that'd be very unfortunate. And I'm using this team uh, because they both have a bonus for... Whoop, alright, we did it. They both have a bonus for the new score attack thing, so I figure may as well get used to both of them now and try using this team. I could just use Geo again, but then I feel like I want to give it a shot with two, um, two bonus characters. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I don't always just want to use, uh, Geo for everything. Geo and Polnaroff for every single score attack that I ever do. Though, unrealistically, I can do that because that's what I've been doing for a while, so. But first I'm going to use Wheelchair Polnaroff and... What's his nuts? I don't know your name. He's the guitar guy with, like, a bird. He's a bird guy. Boop. And we're in there again. Let's go back in here. I think I've said before uh, how I don't remember a vast majority of JoJo character names unless they were named after a rock band, and even then I don't remember exactly who they are sometimes. And, like, I have troubles remembering who is Whamu and who is, um, Cars because they look kind of similar, except for one's green, and I cannot remember for the life of me which one was green. I know which one is Cars, because it's the one with the the, the crazy hair, the one who, who was hiding the hair all along, so I can tell that part easy, but some other stuff, not so much. So, for example, Bird Guy, don't remember his name. I think it might be uh, Big Bird. Let's go Big Bird. There you go. Big Bird in a wheelchair. The power, the powerful team. They're so powerful, they're easily beating the shit out of this. Actually, it's because this, uh, it's because I'm using two extremely high powered guys on low level people. That's why it's being so easy right now. But it's fine. Let's go back in here. Man. It's a shame Oingo Boingo came so after I was depleted out of every single diamond that I owned. So I would totally pull on him. But the problem is, is uh, I don't have anything to pull with them, so they're gonna have to just be on wait. But with some of the tickets coming in, maybe I'll just get it randomly. Actually, I think I have an additional ticket somewhere, so maybe I'll use that ticket when I'm done. There go. When I'm going to check for some hearts to continue playing this event. Boom boom. Go in there, go in there. I don't know why I'm playing this. It's to keep my sh skills sharp. There's no reason for me to play it, but I am still playing it regardless. No, no, it's fun. Mess around like a guitar guy whale. Got some more points. Alright, now I'm gonna fight this guy who I also don't know the name of. I think he's from part 5 kind of looks like oh that's shades because his stand has shades i don't remember his name though i just remember that he has shades that's about it let's go in here all right we're never gonna get <laughs> we're never gonna get any actual practice as long as these guys keep completely eviscerating every single person we run into but it's fine. It's better to eviscerate than to fail to kill. 
Because that would be very sad if they actually failed to kill any of these people. Yep, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh no! There we go. Yes, last second. 40? I could have swore I got to 50 or something. I was wrong. As always, I'm always wrong. So let's keep going and then we'll go to the first boss fight. Now here's the question, will he do anything before I kill him? Because I feel like what's about to happen here is that I'm going to absolutely ass blast him because I'm so higher level than him. So he's not going to do anything. Let's see. Oh no. He's going to... Okay. That's annoying. But not deal breaking. Let's go in here. Clear these out. There we go. And then he should be close to dead. I'm surprised he's not dead. That just goes to show you how extremely weak Birdman is. Go in there. Go in there. No, no, he's dead after this, actually. <laughs> yeah, there was no way in hell he was about to survive getting sorted in the damn face. Uh. I don't tell me it's one of those get a hundred in a row things. I hate these. They're annoying. I never make them the first time. There we go. Let's go in there. Let's go in there. Go in there. Go in there. Ah, oh, damn it! Fuck. I was off by 20. I'll come back to you, one of the Oingo Boingos that I cannot remember the name of. Here they go. Oh, that's annoying. I hate when that happens. Alright. Let's collect some of this. Go in here. Do I have another ticket? I do have a ticket. But I have it for a coin pull. Ah. Useless asshole lady. Ruining my pool chance. Let's go in here. Get some tasty, tasty points. That's right, these reset every single time. I'll look those up later. Go get some of these. Use a heart. Just to keep things going for a bit. There we go. I really hope, again, that the guy I've been using... The two dudes I'm using is something that can actually trigger the effect, because if it's not, it's very unfortunate. That's how this event was structured the first time uh, it came around. I just realized that this event has been exclusive to part three people, so I wonder if they're just going to keep it that way. Hmm. Could be. Could be. And also the answer is no. No one is going to actually live long enough for me to do anything. What the hell do you do, chicken man? Chicken Guitar Man, what do you do? Tell me, what do you do? I want to know. Can you show me? There we go. I wonder if Phil Collins has been made a reference in JoJo's yet. I feel like there has to be at some point. Coming in the air tonight, there has to be a stand name for someone. Alright. Alright, three points, not bad. And of course you level up. There you go, Chicken George. Rock on. He seems so unhappy with the entire situation with his rock band. Can I buy anything with my points, by the way? Nope, only 22. Only 22. Can you still... Yeah, this... Oh, thank God they fixed this. Previously, you had to um, go in there manually, which really sucked. Okay, let's see. Definitely getting that 10 summon. Alright. Let's get, let's get one more in here, then we'll call it a... Actually, you know what? I feel like... Uh, let's just call this an overall... No. No. I'm going to save you for later. Did I get this? Yes, I did. I got to save it for later. I got to train up my chicken and my wheelchair to 
to see if they truly make the perfect pair, the perfect team. Uh, okay, there you go. The greens thing is that since I don't know what the hell this character's name is, I don't know how to find him. So, that's probably why this thumbnail has a chicken on a wheelchair. To be fair, I know how to spell Polnaroth. The only difference is that um, I don't have a clean JPEG or PNG of wheelchair Polnaroth, so I've just been using a wheelchair to uh, say that this is Polnaroth until I can find one. One never showed up, and to be fair, I haven't been super hard looking for it, but... So, there you go. There's the answers for why there's a bunch of wheelchairs all over my Better Better Pop videos. Ah, there we go. And I would say that's enough for a video. Alright, kick some ass. We don't know what this chicken man does. I assume whatever he does, he rocks. And he's gonna go great with uh, wheelchair. There we go. That's just for my OCD. So, I hope you liked me just messing around in the Oingo Boingo world. I'm gonna keep on... I have to grind all this out because I love these events because it helps me get a lot of stuff. And also like the Oingo Boingos. So I want all their stuff. There is a lot to this fucking thing. I did not realize. The only bummer about it is that there's no diamonds, but you also get a free ticket from it, so eh, to me it kind of evens out. Anyway, until next time, if you liked the video, leave a like, and join me for whatever I decide to play next. It probably won't be Hello Kitty. Might be not. Eh. No. No. One Hello Kitty video for now. One 40-minute Hello Kitty video for now. Anyway, I'm rambling on. See you all later. Goodbye. Have a nice day.